Yes, dear students, <coughs> welcome to Diamond Group of Institutions. So, myself, Mr. Shri Kumar sir. So, today we are going to uh, going <coughs> to the twenty fourth grade class, dear students. So, already we started the exercise two point two. So, in the exercise two point two, having the ten questions are there already. Uh, I taught you one two question number one to five questions. I taught you, and we are. This question I give for Omar. So now we are going to the seventh question. Is there, dear students? So what is the seventh question? I want to read the question. Using theorem two point one, prove that a line drawn through the midpoint of the side of the triangle is parallel to the another side, bisect the third side. Recall that you have proved it is class which one nine. So question we can. So using the theorem two point one. Prove that a line drawn through the a midpoint of the one side of the triangle is parallel to the another side bisect the third side. This is the question. Okay. So here, so what is the question? When we are looking the diagram, so ABC is the one of the triangle, and here D is the midpoint. D is the midpoint. Here a line is there. So that line is. We are denoted by L. This line is passes through the one side of the triangle is midpoint. A midpoint is it? Oh, what is it doing? It passes through it. Jaa raha hai. Jaane ke baad, that line is parallel to the second side. In this triangle, first side this is, second side this is, and third side this is. Okay. So one of the line is there that is passes through the midpoint of the one side. एक मिड पॉइंट से वो पास हो रहा है बोले तो पास होने के बाद वो सेकंड साइड को पैरेलल रहेंगे वो थर्ड साइड को भी क्या हो जाएगा मिड पॉइंट से पास हो जाएगा बोल के रो तो रो बोल के बता रहे दिस इज द क्वेश्चन ओके सो नाउ वी विल सी द सॉल्यूशन डियर स्टूडेंट्स सो फर्स्ट स्टेप फर्स्ट स्टेप हियर कंसीडर ए बी सी इज इन व्हिच ए बी सी इन व्हिच डी इज द मिड पॉइंट ऑफ द ए बी डी क्या है मिड पॉइंट ऑफ द ए बी So D is the midpoint of the A A B. Sorry, uh, A B. So we can write here A D by A D by D. Both of these sides are is equal to one. We are taking A D by D B is equal to one. We are taking why we are taking the one. Suppose we will multiply the cross. It is become A D is equal to D B. A D is equal to D B. A D upon D B is the DB when we are multiplying here, it will become AD is equal to DB. AD equal to DB means both are the equal. Midpoint means this is also half, this is also half. Yeah, this is one unit means this also one unit. This is two unit means this is two unit because D is the midpoint of the AB. Okay, so then so we can say so this is completed. Okay, next up, what is the sentence here? So line L is drawn from the Here, line L is drawn through the line drawn through the midpoint of line drawn through the which one drawn through the D such that D such that Such that so L is parallel to the DC. So question is what L is the parallel to the DC. So a line D line say, which one line D is the midpoint is there in this D a midpoint say a L one line passes for I will write so so D L means L is the parallel to the DC. So understand so A D by D B is equal to One first condition. Second, a line. This L is the line. This line is passes through the which one? D. D is the color. One passes through the chart. Jaane ke baad. So already is telling this L is parallel to the DC. When we are looking, L is parallel to the DC. No, L is parallel. Sorry, L is parallel to the BC. Means we can write here. D L is parallel to the which one? BC. DL is parallel to the BC. Then, so this L is here. L is L is intersect 
इंटरसेक्ट एट ई ऑन द लाइन ऑन द साइड ऑन द साइड ए सी ऑन द साइड ए सी ए सी के ऊपर इंटरसेक्ट हो चुका है ए सी के ऊपर ई पॉइंट के ऊपर इंटरसेक्ट हो चुका है वन मोर टाइम आपको मैं बताऊंगा डी इज द मिड पॉइंट ऑफ द ए बी मीन्स वी कैन से ए डी बाई डी बी इज इक्वल टू वन बोले तो दोनों को वन एक ऐसा आएगा बोले तो वी कैन से राइट किया ए डी इक्वल टू वॉट डी बी दोनों भी एक को एक्वल हो जाए लाइन एल इज ड्राउन थ्रो द बी सच दैट एल इज पैर टू द बी सी दिस लाइन इज पैर टू द बी सी देन दिस लाइन इज इंटरसेक्ट द एट द पॉइंट ऑफ ई ऑन द लाइन ए सी ए सी के ऊपर जो यल है ई पॉइंट के ऊपर क्या हो चुका है इंटरसेक्ट हो चुका है देर फोर वी कैन राइट ए सॉरी डी इज डी इज पैरल टू द बी सी देन वी कैन राइट एयर ए अपॉन ए अपॉन ए सी इज इक्वल टू ए डी अपॉन वॉट ए डी अपॉन डी बी वॉट इज द रूल दिस इज द बी पी डी बी पी डी आर थेम्स थेरम बेसिक प्रपोर्शनिटी थेरम वेल टू पैरल इक्वल द साइड आर प्रपोर्शनल ए डी बाई डी बी ए बाई डी सी आगे हमको पता है डी इज द मिड पॉइंट ऑफ द ए बी सो दैट्स वाई वॉट ई इज द ई इज द मिड पॉइंट ऑफ मिड पॉइंट एक लाइन पासिस होके जाने के बाद वो लाइन दैट लाइन इज पैरल टू द बी सी वो लाइन सेकेंड लाइन को सेकेंड साइड को पैरल रहे तो दट इज द When it is intersect with the third side, so the third side intersecting point also what midpoint of the AC. There is a question. O question is asked. So, for this, we have to do. Consider ABC in which D is the midpoint of the AB. D is the midpoint of the AB. Then AD by DB is equal to one. Why we are taking AD by DB is equal to one means AD is equal to BD. Both sides are equal. Midpoint means that side also equal part. This side also. Equal part. So then, so line L is drawn through the D. So means uh, this is the one of the line. This is drawn through the so D. So D is a O pass which is there. Right? This L is parallel to the B C. Condition L is parallel to the B C. Then D L is parallel to B C. L is intersect at E E on the side which one on the side A C A C के ऊपर E point के ऊपर L इंटरसेक्ट होके गए इसके लिए वी कैन राइट डी इज पैरल टू द बी सी दिस डी इज पैरल टू द बी सी वेन द एक ट्रेवल के अंदर दो साइड को इंटरसेक्ट होके जो जाने वाला लाइन वो थर्ड साइड को पैरल रहे तो द प्रपोजल साइड आर इक्वल मीन प्रपोजल साइड विच वन आई टू ए अपॉन ई सी ए अपॉन ई सी इज इक्वल टू ए डी अपॉन डी बी इस बी पी डी थे बेसिक प्रपोर्शनिटी थे Then I'll be given that D is the midpoint of the AB means similarly E also the midpoint of the AC. This is the solution of the seventh question, dear students. And eighth question also similar is there. Eighth question also theorem is there. That theorem we use it and do the solution. Eighth question we will do the homework. Let us discuss about the question number nine, dear students. Yes, dear students. Now we are going to question number nine, dear students. Eighth I given for homework. I want to read the question number the ninth dear students. What is the question? ABCD is a trapezium in which AB is parallel to the BC. So and its diagonals are intersect each other at the point of the O. Show that AO by BO, AO by BO is equal to CO by CO by BO. No question? क्या पूछा? उसके ऊपर हम चाहेंगे. Okay. So what is the question? ABCD is a ABCD is a trapezium. AB is parallel to the which one CD? Both of them are parallel lines. Then 
Then here two diagonals are there. Which one? AC one of the diagonal and BD one of the diagonal. Both are intersect at the point of the O. So O के अंदर intersect हो चुका है दोनों intersect diagonals. Then what is the question here? We should be told here AO by OB, AO by OB and CO by OD. So A दोनों को करना. AO by this AO by OB, CO by OD को कौन क्या करना? Prove करना. Okay. So now look at the dear students. What is given? So what is given? That is only I wrote here. So here ABCD is a trapezium. ABCD is one of the trapezium. Here already told AB is parallel to the DC. So AB is parallel to the DC or CD. Then diagonals intersect AC, AC and BD intersect at the point of the O. Don't know which half they are. AC and BD are intersect at the point of the O. This is the given. Okay. So to prove what we can prove here. No, kya question pucha? So question is what? AO by OB is equal to CO by OD. It is asked. Okay then. Construction. We are taking the construction. Draw the EOF. EOF is parallel to the AB also and parallel to the DC also. Already DC is parallel to the AB. Similarly what we do? AB. EOF is parallel to the AB also and CD also. Okay. So then. So now. In now I am taking in the triangle ACD. Where it is? So look at the board. In this trapezium here is there. Which one? ACD like that is there. A triangle can under many separate area. A, C and D. Here uh, O is there. Okay. Here E is E and O. Okay. Now I took the in this triangle A trapezium के अंदर I took here A, C, D one of the triangle separate. Okay. A, C, D. Here O, E is parallel to the C, D because only by the construction. What is the reason? By Construction. Okay. By construction, EO is parallel to the CD. EO kya hai? CD ko parallel. Then we can write AE upon ED, AE upon ED, and AO upon OC. What is the reason? This is what? This is the BPT. Here. BPT is here. Equation 1. Equation 1. Next. What I took here in triangle ABD, where it is here is there. I took here like that diagram is there. Here A, B, and D. Yeah, this is the E and O is there. I took this much only. Look at the board directions. Which triangle I took from here to here and this is. This triangle only I took. This is not there yet. You think it A nine here. I took here A B D triangle. In this triangle, E O is E O is parallel to the A B. A B ko E O kya hai parallel. This is so. This is also by construction. By construction. Okay. This is also by construction. Then we can take what. ED by which one? So ED by EA and OD by OB. We can take you know here in this triangle. ED by ED by EA and BO by OB. We can take ED by EO, BO by OB. We can take. Then next step. हम को ये मिला. This is also what? This is also BPT theorem. This is BPT theorem. BPT theorem. Then what I am doing? I thought you understood this one. What I am doing here? I am taking the reciprocal of the this one. So when I am taking the reciprocal, it is become AE by ED is equal to OB by which one? OD. This is the equation second. This is the equation second. So when I am taking the this one first one and second equation afterwards. Now I'm ready. From equation, equation one, 
and two we get we get to get the bond dear friends yes yeah. ae by ed ae by ed is equal to ob by od and here ob by od here also i am taking ae by which one ed is equal to ao by oc ao by oc ao by oc is there so look at both are same that's why we can write here which one ob by ob by od is equal to ao by oc but what we can prove here what we can prove here ao by what we can do here ao by bo ao by bo is equal to co by od nothing so what you do here is for cross multiplication of the so make sure here this ob you bring this side already here ao is there this ob bring this side that is become a denominator already here od is there Here C O C is there, no? that is you bring this side and become here. Here A O by O B, A O by O B is equal to C O by C O D. Understand? This is the our answer, dear students. I thought that you understood very well. <coughs> you understood very well, dear students. Yes, dear students. So one more time, I want to explain this question. Question is what is given? A B C D is a trapezium. A B C D one of the trapezium is that A B and D C are the parallel lines. A B and D C are the parallel lines, and uh, A C and B D are the diagonals. Both are intersect at the point of the O. Then we should be prove that A O by O B is equal to O C by C B O D. हम क्या करने का है? A O by O B and O C by O D we should be prove here. Then what we can do do here? Consider the A O F is parallel to the A B A O E O F is the parallel to the A B. ये लेना चाहिए. Then proof. What is the proof here? I explained to you. I took the separated triangle A C D here. A C D in this triangle E O is the parallel to the D C. E O is parallel to the D C. Then we can write A E by E D A O by O C. So this is the first. This is the B P T theorem. Similarly, we took here A B D triangle. A triangle, A B D triangle. Here, E O by A B is the what parallel lines. So that we can write A D E D by A E upon is equal to D O by O B. इधर लिखिए. इसको reciprocal करें क्योंकि ये triangle ऐसा है, एक ये है. इसके लिए हम reverse करें तो, so we will get here A by E D, A by E D is equal to O B by O D. This is second equation. When when from equation one And two, we get what A E by E D, O E O B by O D, and A E by here is A E by E D is equal to A E by O C. So both are equal. No, that's these two are also equal. But our question is what A O by O B upon O C by O D. Nothing. O B को इधर लेके आना, O C को उधर लेके आना. इसके लिए O C become a here numerator and O B is become a denominator. What we can do here? A O by O B is equal to OC by what? OD. Answer proved. Okay, let me say. There is nothing is there there, students. So this is a very very easy question. Okay, I thought you understood. Let us discuss about the question number ten. Yes, dear students. Now we are going to the question number ten. <coughs> the diagonals of the quadrilateral ABCD is uh, intersecting each other at the point of the O such that. AO by BO is equal to CO by DO. Show that ABCD is a trapezium. So previous question में क्या था? Trapezium था. Trapezium के अंदर जो triangle थे उसका side proportional है बोलके prove करने का था. लेकिन अब क्या करें? उसका side proportional दे देने के बाद वो parallel में parallel में तो the the four sides close the figure. एक four side इसका four lines का close figure रहे. So उसको क्या क्या बोलते? Parallel. Parallel के अंदर बहुत सारे types हैं. उसके अंदर रेक्टेंगल है स्क्वायर है और ट्रैपिज्म है काइट है सब कुछ है 
सो वो सभी के अंदर एक ट्रैपिजन भी एक क्या है एक टाइप ऑफ वन वन ऑफ द टाइप ऑफ द क्वारेटर ओके सो हमको क्या करने का है वो क्वारेटर तो उसको हमको प्रूव करने का है कि दैट इज अ ट्रैपिजन ओके सो हियर दिस इज ए बी सी डी इज अ वन ऑफ द ट्रैपिजन सॉरी वन ऑफ द क्वारेटर ए बी एंड सी एंड डी डी एस एंड ही टोल्ड द डायमंड्स आर इंटरसेक्ट एट अ व्हाट डायग्नोस्टिस Meet at the AD side to meet. Okay. Then now we are taking triangle. This one, which one ABD? So look at. I am taking the triangle in this one. Diagonal look at here. I am taking the triangle AB and D. I am taking the this one triangle. Okay. In this triangle, already we know that EO is parallel to the AB. What is the reason? That is by construction. हमने कंस्ट्रक्शन किए थे इसके लिए बाय कंस्ट्रक्शन ओके बाय कंस्ट्रक्शन वी टू किए ईओ इज पैरेलल टू द एबी देन वी कैन राइट व्हिच वन ईडी बाय ईए इज इक्वल टू डीओडी बाय ओबी वी कैन टेक आर वी कैन राइट हियर रेसिप्रोकल ए ई बाय ईडी या बीओ बाय ओडी ऐसे लिखिए सेकंड सेक्शन व्हेन From equation one and two we get. From equation here is one, equation here is two. When we are getting here, so what will become? Look at here B O by B O by D O is there. Here also B O by D O is there. So that's why we can write A O by C O is equal to A E by E D. So A E by C E D. Then how do we know that? What O E is parallel to the O E is parallel to the D C. So by conversion of the B P D, you know. और इनको भी पैरल है ईओ एबी को भी पैरेलल रहे तो सीडी इज पैरेलल टू द एबी सीडी इज पैरेलल टू द एबी देन इन द ट्रैपेज द वन ऑफ द पेयर ऑफ द साइड्स साइड्स आर पैरेलल सो हियर एबी इज पैरेलल टू द सीडी देन टू साइड्स आर पैरेलल वी कैन से द गिवन कोऑर्डिनेटल एबीसीडी इज अ व्हाट एबीसीडी इज अ ट्रैपेजम बोल के हम बोल सकते हैं ओके आई थॉट यू अंडरस्टूड दिस क्वेश्चन टुडे वी कंप्लीटेड द एक्सरसाइज 2.2 डियर स्टूडेंट्स नाउ वी विल गो टू द सम क्राइटेरिया ऑफ द सिमिलरिटी ऑफ द ट्रायंगल इसके अंदर डियर स्टूडेंट्स इसके अंदर थ्री थ्योरम्स है वन इज एंगल 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 थ्योरम वन इज देयर एंड अनदर वन साइड 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 थ्योरम ऑफ हाउस इज देयर साइड 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 थ्योरम इज देयर एंड साइड एंगल साइड थ्योरम इज देयर इसके अंदर सिलेबस के अंदर साइड एंगल साइड इन 2.5 निकाल चुके हैं और 2.4 आल्सो वो भी निकाल चुके हैं आपको दिया है कौन सा टू पॉइंट फोर टू पॉइंट थ्री एक थेरम दिया गया है इसके बारे में हम क्या करेंगे अब डिस्कशन करेंगे ओके आफ्टर द टू पॉइंट थ्री लिविट द टू पॉइंट फोर आल्सो टू पॉइंट फाइव आल्सो देन यू स्टार्ट द एग्जाम्पल क्वेश्चन डी स्टूडेंट आई थॉट यू अंडरस्टूड टूडे दिस एक्सरसाइज लेट एस गो टू द नेक्स्ट वन यस डियर स्टूडेंट्स सो नाउ वी आर गोइंग टू डियर थेरम टू पॉइंट थ्री फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल आई वॉन्ट टू रीड इन इफ 
in two triangles corresponding angles are equal then their corresponding sides are in the same ratio and hence the two triangles are similar we should be prove that okay so hum ye theorem kya bata raha hai if in the two triangles ek do triangles hai triangle is abc one of the triangle and def another one triangle when we are comparing the these two triangles here the corresponding angles are equal iske andar corresponding angles equal rahe to उसका साइड्स प्रोपोर्शनल रहेगा और प्रोपोर्शनल रहे तो बोथ ट्राइंगल्स आर वन द बोथ आर द सिमिलर ट्राइंगल्स ऑलरेडी आई इन्फॉर्म टू यू सो आई डेट डॉट यू द सिमिलर ट्राइंगल्स ऑल कॉन्ग्रेंट ट्राइंगल्स आर सिमिलर बट ऑल सिमिलर ट्राइंगल्स आर नॉट ए कॉन्ग्रेंट सिमिलर रहे तो उसका क्या मीनिंग रहेगा द बोथ टू ट्राइंगल्स आर सिमिलर द वी कैन से the two triangles are similar the property of the similar triangle is what the angles are equal but sides are proportional then congruent triangle properties of the congruent triangle is what angles also equal sides also equal okay so now we are comparing here okay in this triangle here angle a is equal to what angle b e is only given the corresponding angles are equal this angle is equal to this one and angle b is equal to what angle E and and angle C is equal to angle F. So this side is equal. Hey, then we can say here. So these three are equal now. So D B by then E. So figure figure. Hum D E F ko dekhe to P Q is cutted to the which one angle side D E or this ko side ko cut kar chuke. Then cut kare to here already know the triangle. A B C is similar to triangle D P Q. What is the reason, dear students? Here, because both are similar. Why reason? So both are the corresponding angles are equal. So here P Q is parallel to the D F. So A B equals equal है बोले तो C F को equal है बोले तो A B P को तो equal बनेगा. So look at the board. The P Q is parallel to the D F. This PQ side is parallel to the EF means these two are what corresponding angles. So corresponding angles are what corresponding angles are equal. So this is the Y, this is the X, this is the Z. Okay, corresponding angles are equal. That's why the triangle ABC is similar to triangle DPQ. So when in this triangle PQ is parallel to the EF, we can write here what here DP. Upon which one B is equal to what D Q upon what Q F. What is the reason? This is the B P T. Here, are we? We know that why he is given that as well. This is the B P T. Here, next we will be compare here when the sides are proportional. Means we can compare here. So A B by which one D E is equal to A C by which one D F. AC by DF. So this is also what. So only these are the similar. Similar means the corresponding angles are similar. This one is similar to this one. A bada. A A कितना है? उसको इतना ही शार्ट है. A similar है. इसको इतना ही शार्ट है. Means sir, we are cutting to the PQ. So how much AB? How much is that? That much only PD is there. Means suppose AB is the four centimeter. Means PD also four centimeter. And AC is the five centimeter. Means sir. DQ also 5 cm. These two sides, a two sides, so AB, AB is equal to the PD and AC is equal to the DQ. We are consider here also 4 cm, here also 4 cm, here 5 cm, here also 5 cm. Then we are adding this equal part. P is equal to Q, QF. These two we are what we are doing? We are adding the these two sides. Sir. We are adding. Okay. Then we are adding this. The half part and the whole part, half part, whole part. So what a proportional side. So this is the reason. Reason. If when we are comparing to the two triangles, two triangles are similar here. Two triangles are similar here. Corresponding two sides are equal. Means third side is automatically what equal. So that's why I am writing here AB upon here AB upon DE is equal to AB upon DE is equal to BC upon This is upon what EF. This is upon EF. So similarly, I am so, I am so. Here is what all of you know that AB upon AB upon DE 
is equal to AC upon which one BF is equal to AB upon so BC upon what is upon EF. So all sides not, sides are here what all sides are here proportional. So do we can so AC AC upon sorry here AC upon AC upon what B F AB upon D AB upon D and BC upon EF and here AC upon what AC upon D F both sides are AC sorry here BC upon BC upon EF and AC upon what D F all sides are here proportional all sides are proportional means we can say triangle ABC is therefore triangle ABC is similar to triangle D F all sides are here both are what both are the proportional side here so I thought you understood very well this theorem so next to two theorems are here uh, what what he did the uh, two theorems are uh, left to the uh, drop to the this is this year syllabus so we will start the next example question dear students i thought you understood today class uh, we will discuss about the next topic in the next class dear students thank you dear students thank you one and all